Zaluxia picking Ember. Here we go. Zaluxia versus Dobby Dobby going into Lucian this time versus Zaluxia's Ember. Three, two, one, brawl! Zaluxia, the person who knocked Dobby into loser's bracket. We'll see if he can do it again here in loser's finals. Dappy only evolution calls in the Valkyrie, finds the guitars, but immediately gets punished by Zaluxia and an excellent bowstring. Huge bowstring. Tosses the bow into the air to punish his landing. Tries to get a weapon of his own, but Dappy punishes with the deal like Graven Cancel uh, neutral light. Zaluxia hits him with the side air, however, goes for that ground pound, doesn't connect. Dappy punishes with the side air and gets hit by a side air of Zaluxia's own. Zaluxia looking to get on top of him, but Dappy with that down light actually catches Zaluxia mid jump. Luxury gets a good side air, can't chase fast enough. One more side air knocks Dobby off the map, but it's not enough to kill Dobby. Going deep, and the ground wow. pound finishes him off. What an excellent option choice from Selection there to be able to toss that weapon, interrupt whatever it was that Dobby was doing, and follow up with the ground pound. But there's the buy trade that sends Selection off the top of the map, and evens up 2 to 2 very quickly. Dobby doing his usual inching off the side of Mammoth Fortress, holding on the guitars, Zaluxia just holding on the bombs, goes for another bomb Ooh. trade. That was not a good trade for Zaluxia, despite the fact that he had the slight health advantage, he's got the defense disadvantage, so he's going to take a lot more damage from things like that, but it, I don't think Zaluxia cares, he just wants more damage on the Dobby. He's switching back to the bow. Can he get on top of Dobby? There's the Nair. So respects the dare and the neutral sick from Zaluxia sends him into the sky and the dare to chase! One more dare, no! Instead oh, goes for the nair but Doppy outside of the hitbox. Down sick not gonna connect. Neutral uh, recovery, excuse me, from Doppy. Sends Zaluxia into the sky. It's Zaluxia switching it up again. Goes to Guitars. Weapon toss down. Air switches it up and picks up the bow into his side sick. Can he keep Doppy off wow. of the wall? I believe that, yep, doesn't reset his jumps because he knocked him off the wall before he could touch it. Zaluxury's offstage game with the bow is fantastic. He goes for those down airs to be able to force them to recover low, and then uses the side air to hit them into the side of the stage and send them flying below it. Very cool to see, even though he's in the orange. Doppy, however, looking for a weapon, has the guitars, tries to get in with them, but Zaluxury is doing so great at tossing his bow in his face and trying to get some follow-up. But there it is, a neutral light into a recovery, sends Zaluxury into the red. Doppy has the opportunity to end the stock really quick and even it up. Doppy with that side air, knocks Zaluxury back. Zaluxury's got to get a little bit more damage onto Doppy if he wants this stock to count. Dodges through the neutral sig. Goes that downer, but doesn't get the stair follow up. Oh, there's the down sig. Right into the down sig. He wanted to get that down light to initiate any sort of string he could get, but Dapu sees the opportunity, gets the down sig, and stops the approach from Zaluxury. Completely. There's the down light. Goes for a stair follow up, but Zaluxury dodges out of it. Zaluxury looking for a weapon. Ground pounds towards it, finds the guitars, but I really don't feel like he wants that. I feel like he wants to go for the bow. Waits for another weapon toss. I wouldn't be surprised to see him throw these into Dapu's face and go for a different weapon. There's the throw, switches it to a different set of guitars. Doppy fishing for nares and dares right now. Just wants to lock Zaluxury down regardless of where he is. And there's the dare to catch him. And Ooh. tries to read the jump up from Zaluxury because Zaluxury's ready for it and dodges. Still though, that entire time while Zaluxury's holding in the guitars, Doppy's punished him severely. Sending him into the red, hitting him with that neutral sig, and putting him into a point where any signature right now would be a kill. When that recovery is what he needed. And Player two wins. Picks him up. Sends him into the sky, and Zaluxry right now is probably thinking about switching back to the Roland. Yeah, Amber being pretty no. low defense, and well, I guess he looks like he's sticking to it. He did have quite he did have quite a bit of control over that match until he got kind of punished by his weapons, um, not really favoring the guitars against Dappy's guns. Deciding to go to the Great Hall. This is definitely a map that Zaluxury seems to favor, even though he had a poor performance on against LEZ. Let's see what he can do. Zaluxury looking for the unarmed. Can't quite get it. Picks up the guitars from Doppy. Um, not going to connect. And Zaluxury, ooh, tries to read the dodge through with that pivot neutral light, but not able to get it. Trying to keep weapons out of Doppy's hands, but Doppy picks up the guns, and now he's got the spacing advantage. Luxury's got to get in, gets in with a dare, and gets a neutral air on a Doppy. Has the bow, catches him with a neutral air, sends him into the sky. Doppy makes it back down safely. Neutral air, juggle again. Can he keep the juggle going this time? No, oh. Doppy makes it to the wall. 
Sluxer with the neutral wow. air again. Neutral airs are just landing all over the place right now with Sluxer's bow, being great at racking up that damage. He's put him into a point where any signature right now from Ember is going to be able to kill him. Go, tosses the bow aside, goes for the dive kick, gets to Sarah with the unarmed combo after he fakes him out the mine, and goes for a ground pound recovery. Sluxer now with the bow again. Can he get the signature? Doppy's starting to fish for signatures. He knows that Zaluxu's got not a lot of defense. Ground Pound not going to connect. Doppy covering that wall with that dare, but Zaluxu with that recovery gives him the room that he needs. And there's the Qatar recovery to finish off Doppy. Zaluxu denies all the weapons, finds the bow of his choice, and a spike ball spawns for Doppy. Toss it into the ground, doesn't quite connect, finds the guitars, tries to go for something, but Zaluxu has been really on point with these neutral on this map. Taking advantage of the platforms and just that hitbox being so quick, so hard to punish, and getting as much damage as he can with that as possible. Recovery again, but Zalotstri able to dodge through it. He makes it out alive. He's in that really deep red, but that side six is going to send Doppy off the map. Can he get the finishing blow? Ooh, There's wow. another Sare to send him to the other side of the map. Another Sare. Gosh, that's round probably pound. Be the no, Doppy recovers high, still gets hit by the recovery, however. But Zaluxury side sig from Zaluxury finishes it off, and Zaluxury looking to get a three stock, two stock minimum right now. Yeah, Zaluxury is taking complete control of the center of the Great Hall, and he's just forcing Doppy to play on the platforms, and that's exactly where he wants them, especially how he's using this bow. Zaluxury is showing that he's completely dominant when he's got the enemy above and around him. Ooh, Katara Taz, Doppy waiting patiently, wants to see how Zaluxury is going to survive, and Zaluxury can't make it, so Doppy's going to clear the board. Doppy holding on to the guns, goes for a down air, but still, Zaluxury's at a solid two stock, or one stock lead right now. Doppy holding on to the guns, hits him with the neutral air, trying to get whatever damage he can. Zaluxury tosses his weapon into him, dodges through it, but gets the dive kick. Zaluxury's trying to do whatever he can to get some damage on him, but Doppy does some unarmed combos of his own, goes for the neutral air combo, doesn't connect. Zaluxury needs to find a weapon. Zaluxury right now is taking a lot of damage off of this fresh stock, and Doppy might be running away, wants to make the comeback, the reverse three stock. Luxury still unable to get anything going, gets the downlight into a neutral air so that he can pick up those guitars. Round pound. Zaluxury able to get the side air, but Dobby's still alive. Zaluxury gonna try to control that wall, but Dobby undeterred. Ooh, that down air sending Zaluxury pretty far down. He's incredibly damaged right now. Dobby goes to the gravy cancel downlight, doesn't connect. The down sig not connecting either. Just throwing out signature after signature, but nothing's landing in the side sig. Side sig from Zaluxury knocks him off the map. Can he get another side air? No, Dobby's gonna recover high, get above him. He makes it back to the platform, but Zaluxury immediately neutral light recovery. Can't chase. But Doppy's now in the red. And there is the down heavy from Zaluxury. Unarmed down heavy sends Doppy off the map. And that is going to give Zaluxury that win. Yes. Tying it up 1-1, one, one, if I'm not mistaken. Tying it up 1-1 one, one in this best of five. Essentially turning it into a best of three. Both players have to win two more matches to be able to move on to grand finals. And here's the legend switch from Zaluxury going to Sir Roland. Asking the chat whether or not this is a best of five or best of three. It is indeed a best of five. Winners, losers, and grand finals are all best of five. Doppy also opted into Nash. Out. Going to his Nash. We got a Nash. We'll see how this works out for Zaluxury, considering I'm sure he was thinking that, that his Roland would be a lot more beneficial against Lucian. But it looks like he has to go Roland against Nash right now. Zaluxury going for the dive hit. kick and Doppy just accepting his, uh, his arrival and punching him in the face. Zaluxury finds the first weapon but tosses it aside. Both players opting for unarmed. Doppy finds a spear, goes for a side light, doesn't connect, and Zaluxury ducks underneath the down light. It's an interesting option from Dobby. Missed the downlight, so immediately ground pounds to punish any sort of 
of Jump Nair or anything like that that Zaluxery could come out with. And now Zaluxery eking into the orange, getting closer to the red. And Doppy has that hammer that he loves so much. If he can get a scoop into an air or a stomp into a Sair. This is going to be looking good. Zaluxery, though, turning it around. Knocking Doppy around. Can't get the recovery. Zaluxery staying close enough. The hitbox won't connect. Ooh, his luxury, however, lands with a side air. Doppy goes for a signature, doesn't quite connect, launches the spear into his face. Still can't seem to end his luxury stock, but there's the side air. Roland's defense coming into play, but can he end his stock? Yes, he can! Side sig from Doppy. Knocks him off the map. Terrifying Doppy. signature usage from Doppy here. Goes for that scoop, doesn't quite connect, but tosses the weapon to his face against the unarmed combo. Side stick from Zaluxery, not gonna connect. Doppy gets a stomp into a scoop, into a gravity cancel, neutral stick, weapon toss. Tries to keep it going with that spear side stick, but not able to do so. But the side air is gonna keep Zaluxery off the map. He gets the wall touch, Ooh, avoids the, the mine. The ground pound. But he is in a lot of trouble right now. Gets caught by the neutral light, doesn't get caught by the chase dodge neutral sig. But Doppy, again, down light side air sends Zaluxery to the other side of the map. Zaluxery now looking at a three stock disadvantage. He's got to make the comeback. Can't hit Doppy yeah. in the mine. This this match is looking a lot like what Zaluxery was doing to Doppy on the Great Hall. Only this time Doppy is in the lead. Goes for these neutral signatures of the Lance. None of them connecting. Doppy chase dodging him with his unarmed and accidentally ground pounds below the stage. Oh, uh, Zaluxery able to punish that dare from Doppy. Gets the ground pound, but Zaluxery already in the orange. And Doppy... He's turning on a whole different level of aggression right now. Can he do it again? Neutral light. Chase dodge. Can't get the Sair. It's Luxury above it. It's Luxury go off the neutral light. Doesn't quite connect. Doppy hits him with another D light side air combo with a spear. Tries to end the stock quickly with a side sink, but doesn't work out. So Luxury hitting with a side light into a side air and gets punished. By a ground pound off the side of the stage. Dodges through the spear. Will Doppy be able to punish? No. Hits him with a neutral air instead of a side air, and it doesn't connect. Ground pound from Doppy. He was waiting for the opportunity. Was sitting there thinking about it. And the second that Deluxe started that jump animation, he's like, crap out. Yeah, ground Bops pound and the stock. Man. Giving it a solid two stock. Taking game three. Putting Doppy two to one over Deluxe No, it's not a best of three. So confusion, I was very sure that I said this was a best of five uh, this entire time. So we're going to continue their matches. Yes, indeed. Losers Finals is a best of five. The Luxury, one more chance to stay inside of this. How is he going to get through this aggression from Doppy? It seems like the Luxury, even with that switch to Roland, was not enough to get past all of the, the stuff. Just all of it that Doppy had. Oh, in regards to that, Ammer, I changed... Um... I'm surprised I haven't updated that in the rule set yet, but winners, losers, and grand finals are best of five. Yeah, in the Google Doc, I, I that needs to be updated because the maps aren't updated in that either, which is kind of unfortunate seeing that this is the rules that we reference. But for this, I wanted this to be best of five because uh, I believe we have the time for today. That's a little bit of confusion. It's going to be updated this week for certain. But yeah, we had best of fives for winners and losers finals last week as well. So let's hope that they get through their bands and we're able to get onto the game four of this losers finals match.
All right, so we are good to go. Everything is cleared up. Doppy bans Great Hall and Mammoth, or Great Mam, and Zalazar gets his pick of the litter. What is he gonna choose, and who is he gonna play? I you saying, I heard someone was playing Illusion, and indeed, Doppy was playing quite a bit of Illusion in this tournament. Yeah, sorry for the confusion. The rule set does definitely need to be updated. It's just something that I was going to get to this week with the change of the maps and how we're going to be doing our, our grand, our, our finals, best of fives. They finally decide on their legends, their maps. is luxury going back to Ember, Doppy sticking with Nash. Game four, I believe we're going to Mammoth Fortress. Three, All right, two, here we one, go. Zaloxery versus Doppy. Zaloxery gets the neutral light into an unarmed string onto Doppy, but backs off immediately afterwards. Gets the bomb toss onto Doppy and Doppy right now, getting handled a little bit. Side light from Zaloxery. Zaloxery only on the guitars, tosses it aside. Doppy already in a deep red. So actually holds on to the mine, tosses it aside, goes for a disco, not quite sure what he's going for there. Doppy trying to hit him with a down air, but he gets hit by recovery instead, so flying off towards the top of the map. Um, oh, Doppy wow. catches it out of his hands, and Zalaxtri knocks him into it! He's gonna give it a ton, he's, he's feeling himself a little that bit, that was a good grab pick. on that bomb was insane, that was almost instantly picking it up as Zalaxtri let that go. Ended up resulting in his death, however. So Luxury finds himself in the orange, but not after hitting him with a side air. So Luxury recovers really low, gets hit by a spear toss. Oh, Ooh. that mine! Barely dodging that mine. Flying through the hair on Ember's head. Doppy holding on to the hammer. It hits him with a side light, sends him flying in a scoop off the top. Doesn't actually kill, surprisingly. Neutral light from Zaloxery. Neutral air from Zaloxery. Yeah, Doppy holding onto the hammer, goes for a side air, doesn't quite work. Zaloxery trying to hit him with his guitars, uses the downer to get closer to the stage. Doppy, gosh, seeing an Ember taking this much damage is kind of ridiculous. And at this point, I think a hammer sidelight might kill. Tosses the guitars into Doppy's face, hits him with a side air. Gosh, any Oh, and the down sig from down. Town Dobby gosh, knocks him down. That down sig is so brutal. It's one of the few. I think attacks in this game that make it look like the ground's actually being destroyed. Nash's signatures are always terrifying. Doppy holding onto the spear, hits him with a neutral light. But still, Doppy's in a position to get killed rather early. Nice D-Light side air, however, sends the Luxury into the orange. Health immediately evened up, and the downlight side air, one more hit could be enough. That might be it. Zaloxery can't touch the wall. Wow. I feel like if he held left, he could have. I'm not 100% sure what happened. Maybe he thought he touched it. Yeah, and, and it just then... fell. Either way, the Luxury not managing to get his jumps back. Takes that lead that he had early on and loses it to Doppy's Nash. Trying to end the stock as quickly as possible. There's the neutral air. Doesn't kill him off the top, however. Goes for a side sing and Doppy punishes with the stair. Doppy answers back with a downlight side air. Can he do another one? No side stick from Zaloxery. Tries to throw it out, but gets punished from Doppy. Downlight side air again from Doppy. Weapon toss, ground pound, not gonna connect as Zaloxery can't touch the wall. Game four going the way of Doppy, 3-1. Yeah,